Hey up. Today, I've come out on my bike. I've not been out on the bike for ages, so I really needed to get some exercise for a start. I've come up to Lime Park, and it's absolutely gorgeous up here.
Hey up. Today, I've come out on my bike. I've not been out on the bike for ages, so I really needed to get some exercise for a start. I've come up to Lime Park, and it's absolutely gorgeous up here. Uh, I'd love to say it's about an hour's drive from my house, but the way that I am, it's more like two. <laughs> I'm so unfit. I had to walk up so many hills today. Absolutely gorgeous, though. I'm up at the cage now. I tried to take a photo on the way up. Got two sheep walking towards me along the path, just up against the skyline. But by the time I got my camera out, they were already past the skyline and the image just didn't work anymore. When they were framed up against the skyline, it was quite nice, but after that, no, it was just rubbish. So come and have a look at the view that I've got now. So what I think I'm gonna do is break out the long lens and see what little images we can see. That's my plan for the moment. Long lens. So I'm sat editing my uh, trip up to Lime Park now and I can't help but feel that the images are pretty rubbish, shall we say. I could use something stronger, but I think rubbish will do for the evening. They're full of grain, not very well composed. You can really see the difference in the two lenses. I really wasn't expecting there to be that much difference between the Fuji 16-55 and then the 70 to 300 Nikon, which I know is an adapted lens and it is old, but I wasn't expecting that much of a change because the difference is massive. Uh, massive amount of grain. It's really show. It's really highlighted how bad my sensor is. It's desperate for a clean, I think, which you would expect after being battered for two years. I've had, in fairness, yeah, I have. I've had it two and a half years, something like that. And I use it as my everyday camera. And I bet it takes a picture every day. Probably, probably about 20 pictures every day. It gets used, it gets left around the house and just picked up to take fit pictures of the family and stuff. And the dog, lots of pictures of the dog. Yeah, well, thank you very much for watching. I had a really nice end filmed Cycling back, thought it'd be fantastic. Cycling back through Middlewood Way, talking to the camera, explaining what was going on, lots of trees flying behind me. All <laughs> the audio's terrible. Well, thanks very much. Take it easy. Talk to you again soon. Bye.